file request has a dedicated tab within Huddle. The process of creating a file request is really straightforward. Just click Create Request and start typing the name of your request. To create bulk requests, you can copy and paste from a list straight into Huddle. Each new line in the box is a separate file request and you can create up to 500 requests in one go in each workspace. Once you've listed out your requests, you can specify which folder you'd like them to be uploaded to. Any existing folder permissions are respected, so you can be sure sensitive information will only be visible to the people with access to the folder you've selected. Next, assign the file requests to the people you'd like responses from. You can assign requests to one or more members of the workspace. Finally, you can set a due date for when you need the information by. And that's all there is to it. You can see the number of requests here. Just click Create Requests. As soon as a file request is created, assignees receive an email into their inbox containing details of the request. Clicking the link in the email takes the assignee straight to the file request tab in the workspace. Let's look at this request in more detail. The first thing I'm going to do is mark this request as in progress. This will send a notification to the requester so they know that I'm working on this request. Responding to the file request is as easy as dragging one or more files into the request in my browser. I don't need any special software and files of up to 10 gigabytes are supported. Once the files have been uploaded, the requester will receive a notification and I can also add a comment if I need to add any additional context. As the requester, I can check the progress of my file requests at any time. The dashboard provides a real-time view of the progress of my file requests and even shows when file requests are overdue. Dropping into a request, I can click on any files that have been uploaded to quickly check if they meet my needs. I can review the file without having to leave Huddle and all the usual features such as approvals, sharing, comments and the audit trail are available to me. Jumping back to file request, I'm happy with the response to this request so I can mark it as complete which will notify the assignee that no further action is needed and automatically updates the overview dashboard. Another great feature that will reduce the amount of administrative work on gathering files are the automatic reminders Huddle sends to assignees the day before and on the day that any incomplete request is due. Updating requests is a breeze. The original requester and workspace managers can change the due date, add or remove assignees and even delete requests, while assignees can add additional assignees in case a request needs to be reassigned to someone better able to respond. Got questions or want to find out more? Visit Huddle Help at huddle.zendesk.com